The KW-2 Self-Propelled Anti-Aircraft Gun SPAAG, was developed by Rotom as a private venture to meet the potential requirement of the South Korean Army. It is a member of the Rotom KW-2 family or wheeled 8x8 armored vehicles. It is worth mentioning that South Korean Army plans to replace its tracked armored vehicles in the rapid deployment and internal security roles. A new wheeled SPAAG might supplement the tracked K-30 Baiho SPAAG. As far as it is known there were no production orders for this artillery system to date. The KW-2 SPAAG is armed with two turret-mounted 30mm anti-aircraft guns. This short-range air defense system ID fitted with thermal-slash-TV tracking system, laser rangefinder, and advanced fire control system. Tracking range is over 7 kilometers. It is an all-weather artillery system which can operate under day or night conditions. A claimed effective range of fire against air targets is 3 kilometers. It might be also used as a ground support weapon. Vehicle has a crew of three, including commander, gunner and driver, however manufacturer suggests that it can accommodate more operators. Driver is seated towards the front on the right side, with the diesel power pack to the left. Commander and gunner are seated in the turret. This self-propelled anti-aircraft gun is based on the 8x8 Rotom KW-2 armored personnel carrier chassis. Vehicle is fitted with Hyundai diesel engine, developing 420 horsepower. The KW-2 has an automatic driveline management system. It has a central tire inflation system, which is adjusted from the driver's station, and is fitted with run-flat tires. This artillery system has an all-welded armored hull. It provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Vehicle can be fitted with add-on armor for a higher level of protection. It is also equipped with NBC protection system.